Okay, hello everyone. In today's video, I'm gonna be teaching you guys how to actually make your build really good. So, yeah, if you want to see that, stay tuned. Let's go. Okay, so first things first. What you really need to do is basically plan it out. Plan out what you want to go, what gen, like basically gen 1, 2, 3, okay? What subclass you want to go? What is your primary focus? So, like, you might want to go for the ability tree, let's say. You might, you might want to go, like, agility, right? You might go want to go, like, strength and get determined soul, or even, like, healer stealer, who fucking knows? Maybe defense, maybe full freaking energy. Plan everything out. Once you've planned everything out, Next step, from levels 1 to 30, you shouldn't care about anything else than leveling up. Like, the only thing on your mind should be leveling up and getting, like, getting accessories. Even if you don't have any accessories, that's all good. So, let's say you want the fur coat, you want something like that, that, that that's pretty good, okay? Pretty nice, okay, for, for sure. But, you don't need accessories to be good. Of course, like the show gloves, the fur coat, all that would help. And also the boss job from here. Everything would, would help if you get it. Don't get me wrong. But you do not need it to make a decent build. Like you, you will need it at the end game. But as of now, like level 30, no, you don't need it. So after you got to like level 30, let's say. Like you just spam uh, freaking phone missions and training. Make sure before, like, before level 35, maybe even 40, get your strength and defense up to 13. Like, you, you need at least, in my opinion, increase strength 2 and increase the uh, defense 2. Just so you can deal, like, a lot of damage and don't die really soon. So, yeah. Okay, before the video continues, guys, if you're finding this video helpful, make sure... To subscribe yo we need that okay that's it let's continue on with the video next thing like by the time you're level 30 you're probably gonna unlock a uh, pod which is right press of that and you in my opinion you should really just macro that because you won't like uh, lose anything if you macro maybe if you have money just spend it on something Spend it on training or something, and even if you if you die, if someone is hunting you, you can just, like, not give a fuck, right? That's really easy. And you just macro it, you just go, like, get tiny task, and do some left clicks, fam G, and eventually you're gonna max it out, which is really gonna help you out in PvP and PvE. After that, you really need to get better at arena right i'm like plat one plat two in arena because i'm just like not playing it simply so i don't need to play it because i'm already maxed but after level 30 every time you need to level up you you're gonna need combat exp and the best way to get it is through arena there's no way around it like elite missions sure they're, they're decent okay yeah but you're gonna need to like wait for Q, for uh, for the Q timer, and you're gonna need to maybe fight like one v four if you don't have a teammate. It's really dumb. It's really it's really boring. In arena, you will get better at PvP just by playing the game, and you're gonna get chests, uh, which is really good, right? So yeah, like after that, maybe you've reached uh, level level forty. You really want to get uh, your gen upgrade. But you don't need to, like, try hard on that. You just, like, continue leveling up and even... Uh, and when there is, like, an event, you just go there, try to win it. If you win it, really good. If, you, if not, it's all good. And it's okay. It's totally fine. You don't need to freaking win every every payload or every turf war, right? It, it's totally fine, even if you lose some. So, yeah. You're gonna get uh, the stage 1 from, gen upgrade, uh, from the generational... Uh, upgrade mission you're gonna get the first one the second is like grips from the opposite faction 
so this is really good for like uh arena again arena is really op for this because those grips uh count too so even if you even if you fight in the arena those grips will count right which is amazing so let's say you win 10 fights and all of them like hypothetically we're speaking right all of them were fire force and you're white clad you just have you just got like what 30 30 grips bro that's amazing you don't need more than 30 i think like it's between 30 to 40 i'm pretty sure like fa uh the faction wins is i i did like 30 wins i think i had 30 wins for the grips i had 35 and the last uh requirement is 20 charts uh, infernalized charts uh, which is pretty easy it's pretty easy to get them like you just kill infernals and maybe you can trade if you have something decent you can trade for infernalized charts which is really good too and that's how you get your generational ability and after after you have everything like this i would really recommend you uh, trying to get like the best accessories in the game right like something from the businessman maybe fur coat is really op you need fur coat right uh burn eye patch i had that but i switched it to another account maybe um uh, cross necklace is good too joker scarf is okay but cross necklace, uh, necklace heals you actually which is like really good uh joker's banana whatever wh literally whatever you want but the best ones i think you really need is fur coat and maybe plague mask plague mask has overall like decent buffs for everything and like cross necklace is uh good too so yeah get you get your accessories and by this time like uh after all this you should have your like all of your abilities from the uh from the normal generation like let's say your gen 3 your, your excalibur you have every ability you have every ability from your subclass the passives you almost you're almost maxed out right what do you do now like from level 40 to 50 well now you can try getting an augment show gloves so this is the time when you when you actually want to like start uh killing bosses more and getting more chests in, a, in any way possible like there's a way to get chests every like five to ten minutes which is pretty easy i can uh i'm, I'm gonna make a video on that so you guys can see and yeah now i'll basically teach you how to do that in the next video probably so yeah stay tuned for that but if you get something good that's really amazing even if you get an augment that that's perfect so yeah like from level 40 to 50 it's the same pro pro uh, process you just freaking what you you just like go to uh phone missions you win arena matches and that's it basically Af like until you're maxed out and i'll and when you're maxed out you can start your stilled of that uh, quest which is really annoying but it's okay you can trade grips with people so yeah it's okay i, I can I'm, i need to do that like maybe uh, tomorrow or something like that i will because like i haven't played on this account because i started a new build which i'm gonna be sho uh, showing you guys pretty soon and yeah uh it's it's gonna be re really good trust like the only thing i'm need I, I need right now is probably a subclass reroll because scientist and sakura don't go too well honestly like there's no m n n not too much combo potential so i'm just gonna uh reroll it i'm gonna get probably priest maybe berserker i'm i'm thinking uh like between those two i'm not sure next thing i'm gonna need like the show gloves the what's it like infernal mask i think from the um, infernal boss here and i'm gonna need like steel of that and an augment uh, that that's it my build is really good bro trust me i don't lose that much like even on 1v3s bro i can win them easily like i can i can show you guys uh sometimes when when we're live maybe and yeah it's really op like when you're maxed out and you become decent at the game just by playing arena and leveling up bro you're gonna become good with whatever you have like let's say guns guns are op bro i i've i've 
I've got clapped with guns, bro. Guns can be really good in the right hands. Trust me. I got Sakura. Sakura is probably one of the best abilities. I'm not gonna lie to you, but... Hey. I'm pretty good with Sakura, so yeah. But anyways. Uh, that's gonna be it for today's video, guys. If you liked it, make sure to like, share, subscribe, and all that shit. And if you have any suggestions, make sure to drop them in the comments. And yeah, that's gonna be it. See you guys in the next video. Goodbye.